Welcome back you two. So the next adventure of 2022, we're off to Folly Farm then in Tenby. So about three years ago, we went to Folly Farm. We had an amazing day, it was fab. We got there for about half past nine and we didn't leave till about 10 to five in the evening. So uh, Riley's been nagging for quite a while now to go back. So we've decided that we're gonna go back, but this time we're gonna camp. They've got a new campsite on site at Folly Farm. So we're actually gonna camp there. We're staying for three nights and uh, yeah, we're really looking forward to it. Had a bit of a problem. I did book it. I booked it online and I booked the wrong dates. So we've got up this morning, looked at our confirmation and realised that actually we're not meant to go until Friday and it's currently Wednesday. But Folly Farm are amazing. We've emailed them last night saying, look, it's our fault. We've made the wrong dates. Could you please change them? And they have. We've got a different pitch, but I'm not worried about that as long as we can still make the dates that we actually planned. So uh, fair dues to Folly Farm for holding us at the last minute. Really appreciate that. That was great. So yeah, we're off. We're going to jump in the camper van, which we haven't really used up until this point that much. Um, it's nearly finished. We've got all the kitchen pod, everything in, the heaters in, the beds all done, granny's beds all done. So it's going to be quite good to actually use the camper with a bit more in it this time. So uh, yeah, we'll give you a little look around the van, how far we've progressed with that. And uh, we're going to all jump in the camper van now and we're going to shoot off down to Tenby. So stick with us and uh, let's go and see what Folly Farm's got to offer. Guys, we're just pulling up to Folly Farm now. It's literally just up the road, two minutes away. And Riley's doing the GoPro while I'm driving. Okay, mate? Yeah. Keeping it steady? Yeah. Good boy. Oh, look at the daffodil. See the buses yet? Yeah.
what was that? It was called Donkey, wasn't it? So guys, we've arrived at Folly Farm campsite. That's our pitch, gravel pitch. Got the awning up because we're going to stay for a couple of days. That's the campsite. Toilet block just by there. And Riley and Mum and Granny and all are just walking down to Folly Farm. So we're going to go down and have a look. So stay with us. So guys, this is the map of the caravan park that we're staying at. And we're just by here in Donkey. And now we're just walking down through by here down to Folly Farm. So those who've been to Folly Farm before, car parks both sides, and then we walk straight down to the main entrance, and there's the big wheel that most of you know. So guys, this is the entrance. This is where we queue up to go in. So guys, Folly Farm. We're off down to the cafe for a cup of coffee. So we're all having a break. Some donuts. <laughs> and a Hershey's chocolate icy slushy thing, which is really nice. Happy? I'll tell Lydia. Say hello to everybody. Hello. Tell everybody where you are. We are in Folly Farm. At Folly Farm, isn't you? Yeah. Well, we're staying here, aren't we? Yeah. We're staying here. Ah. Say, see you in a bit. See you later. So welcome to Farmer Glynn's Jolly Barn. What have we got in here then, mate? Wow, oh, look at that down here. Go on then. Riley, go on. And then go through the seat. And I'll video coming down the other side, okay? So. We have some baby goats. Can you do the baby goats then? Should point to them. They're down by there, aren't they? In the feeding book. And some more by there, by your mummy. Christmas. <laughs> well, your camera shot. Cockroaches. Oh, we're fighting. You can't swim with them. Yeah, they'll have petting times later on. We can see them smooth. Look at baby lamb. I don't know if you guys can see, but there's one just tucked in the trough over there. Might be a bit too far away for the GoPro, but there's a little owl up in the box. Massive chalkboard for the kids. having a sleep. You're going to hold it for me, okay? 
Oh, is he fast asleep? Having a dinner. Hello. So, Mini, Welsh Pony, Adria, Arabian, a Thoroughbred, and a Shire Horse. Wow, you're tiny compared to them. This is Alice and Dixie. This is the hand milking parlour and Riley's having a go at milking a cow. Sh show me how you do it now. Show me how you do it. Squeeze the teeth still and then more comes out. Milk. So here at Folly Farm they use the power of solar and that's the solar panel set up. And they also burn wood chips to heat the park up. You know, they, they haven't moved for a while. <laughs> Chilling. It's quite a warm day today. Three little mates all sat together by there. And one on his own. Some little baby chips, guys. Thank you. Now you've got the reach back. Do not feed little monsters in cages. <laughs> what is it? Snake. Snake. He's a big one, isn't he? Oh! Oh, oh, oh. oh my god. <gasps> Tall guys just up by there.
difficult to see, guys. Little monkeys. Well, not little. They're having their dinner, aren't they? Yeah. Is it cool here, Ali? Yeah, but there's mummy. Mummy's down the bottom. Weather, well, the weather definitely hasn't disappointed. It is gorgeous. Blue skies. A couple of clouds, but look at that. The penguins. Pond's down the bottom. Oh, yeah, can I wait? Oh, look at the flamingo, look, he's washing that. Thank you, guys. <laughs> you made you jump there, Riley. Nice, fair play.
So guys, that's probably the end of day one. Well, in the Folly Farm. Um, all the traffic's leaving, as you can see behind me. It's the car parks. So we just walked to the top of the car park and there's our caravan site. So this was the entrance that we pulled up earlier on. Uh, there was nobody in it when we came here and it just opened up, recognised our registration and we went to our bay. And there's our set up. Time for a beer, I think. Where our bitch is called Donkey. Ready to life, sir. <laughs> So guys, we just met the warden, really nice guy, uh, rolling rucks, he spoke with you, um, yeah, really, really tidy, he's a really nice guy. So they're sorting our passes out to get into the farm tomorrow, and uh, yeah, told us a bit of information and what we can see in the landscape and where to park if we're going to go into Tenby. Really, really nice, really, really nice guy. So uh, yeah, the site is beautiful. So there's outside facilities just by here, so you can wash all your dishes and everything. And then uh, this is the toilet box, so uh, I'll go in there, but obviously I can't video if uh, if people are inside. So I'm lucky there's not many people in here. So nice size showers, place to put your clothing, hang your clothing up, some sinks, toilets, really, really clean, spotless, guys. So guys, here's your outside cleaning facilities. Underneath a bit of a trough to keep you dry. So talking to the warden, there's a walk down through the meadow that they've mowed out. Um, and when you walk down through the meadow, you can see the rhino paddock. So uh, I think I'm going to take Riley down in now and have a walk around it. So guys, there's the nice little kids park up the top of the site. It's where the tents and the camping are. Me and Riley's going down through here somewhere. If you want to see. Here we go, Riley. It's down here, mate. The meadow walk. Hopefully, we might be able to get to see rhino. some rhinos down the bottom, I think. No. So, you could also hire out like the old gypsy type caravans, guys, just down the bottom by here. I can't video too much because people are staying in them. Uh, but yeah, looks tidy. They look really nice. Some statics as well. I think the site's developing and it's getting really nice. We paid uh, 200 pounds or 198 pounds for the three days, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, leave Saturday, and that's entry into the farm and uh, for the three days and the camping. I think we've got to turn right there, Ali. Yeah. Okay, hang on. So guys, looks like they're going to extend the park down. So there's looks some concrete hard standings by there. Go. Oh, sorry. Oh, sorry, there you go. There you go, he's gone. <laughs> Riley don't like flies. <laughs> um, so, I don't know if you can see it, guys. Where the yellow mini digger is, there's some shapes moving behind those trees, and that's the rhinos. I don't think we're going to get much closer, but yeah, that's the rhinos that we can see down through there. So, guys, we're down the bottom of the paddock now. It's a really weird feeling because we can hear sheep in the background by here, and when we look over, to this building just by here. You're not gonna be able to make it out because I'm only on a GoPro, but there's actually rhino in the field looking at this over by there. So it's weird, you've got sheep in the background and rhinos in front of us. But wow, what and amazing. Little and little birds tweeting in there. But isn't it wicked seeing those rhino over by there? They're a lot closer, are they, than what we can see them on camera? But apparently, oh, apparently tonight we might be able to hear the, um, well, we will hear the lion roar. Um, we probably hear some cheetahs apparently making that like the cheetah noise that they make um, And was it a crane he said Riley a bird crane yeah. that he said we'll hear making the noise as well So uh, the, the warden is really really friendly guys really really nice gave us plenty Don't have your shoes. Look at your shoes now Look. He, um, he, he's just, he was just really friendly, he just told us all the information we wanted to know, told us about this walk and uh, had a wicked uh, chat with us. 
So uh, yeah, I, I really highly recommend this campsite. It is absolutely stunning. It is a small little campsite, but it is really, really well looked after, really clean. Everything's brand new. It's really, really nice. Wi-Fi is amazing. You can uh, watch Netflix as well. Riley's got his phone on YouTube, so he's happy. He's beaming about that. So yeah, just absolutely fab. Just highly recommend it, guys. Really, really do. So uh, yeah, right, let's get back to the van. Say good morning, guys. Guys. Do you sleep well? Yeah. Have a nice sleep? Yeah. We didn't hear the lion roar, did we? So we've been up for a shower, haven't we? Yeah. Nice and warm. Breakfast time. Too busy in you. Go have breakfast first. Rebel Box Adventure! Day two? Yeah, day two. And where are we? Bolly Farm. Is it good? Yeah. So there's quite a few people already, guys. It's 10.38 in the morning. And as you can see, it's quite busy. Cash point on site as well, guys, if you need it. And then there's a shop there with all bits and pieces. Shop's quite reasonably priced. We got right here for a few bits and pieces yesterday, and it was quite uh, reasonable. <laughs> Massive playground for the big ship. Two big ships. One by there. One up there. There's the tigers and the lions. Try and get a bit closer. Oh my, they're like so peaceful, me there. There's the baby camel. He's big, isn't he? It's mad, isn't it?
guys. So guys, this is the rhino pen. And yesterday we were in this field just over there where me and Riley walked down that night. So that's how close you can actually camp. Where you can see the digger just up by there. That looks like they're doing hard stands for some static caravans. So they're literally going to be looking over the rhino pen all night. So yeah, it's really tidy. Where are we going, Riley? Giraffe. Up to the giraffes. <clears throat> Who's up? Oh, they're out. I can see them over there.
You got it. Ready? Ferris wheel. It's big. Hey guys, so we're inside the Ferris wheel, aren't we? Yeah. And we're just, uh, oh, we're just going. Yeah. <laughs> so the Ferris wheel um, is tokens. It's two tokens per person and a token's 50 pence. So you can't grumble like that. You might be able to see Granny down on the bench there, mate, waving. And this is a overhead view of the park. So, a bit like a drone view. <laughs> But without the drone. So these big barns are where we were in just now. That's the big kids play area. Um, the tractor ride is just over the far end over there. And the drafts are just down the bottom, just down in that area. So, uh, and if I turn around, okay, ready? You can see our camper van is just up on the edge, right up the far end. That's where we're camping guys. So you can see how close we're camping to the actual place. This is the car park where everyone parks. I'm mega impressed with this place guys. Mega impressed. See the kids track the ride there where they can uh, pedal around a uh, course. Okay? A yeah. little bit nervous at the moment, aren't you? <laughs> Then, isn't it? This is the big boat that we pointed out to earlier on. So, and we've walked right the way around there. I don't know if you can see just by here is the camels, so that's where they were. And then this building, this section here, and over here is where the rhinos were. So, guys, I don't know if I've already told you, um, so we were going to cut the folly farm anyway. Uh, it worked out about 80, 89 pounds for the day. Um, so we looked on the website, the actual campgrounds here, uh, and for three days and three days entry, camping and into the Folly Farm was 198 pounds. Now, that ain't bad. That's really good. And we're moving again, are we? It's, it's fabulous value for money. And for what Riley's been able to do and go and see and all the animals, it is absolutely fab. Well worth the money. Can it, I really highly recommend this if you've got little ones, even if you haven't got little kids, come and have a look because I think you'll be gobsmacked with just how much is here. It is absolutely fab. So guys, our camper van, I don't know if my finger's in the right place, is about by there. <laughs> you see our warning. The competitors are going out now. <laughs> Restaurant. restaurant. So we're at Folly Farm restaurant and we're gonna have some food. We've got someone visiting our table. <laughs> Who's that? Cow. With cow. He's having dinner with us, isn't he? Yeah.
Morning mate. Morning. Did you have a nice sleep? Yeah. Day three. Last day today, isn't it? Yeah. You had a good time? Yeah. Good. I don't know if I mentioned it guys, but there is a dog walking area as well. I don't think dogs are allowed in the farm, but if you do bring them camping, they can stay in your van and then they've got a big dog walking exercise all fenced in by there. Do a lap of the course. Wrong way. No, turn right that way. Because that's the way you've got to go. See you in a minute. No bumping, Riley. This is the shipwreck. Play area. Just don't make Riley out by there then. There he is.
do we know? On the spinny brake you Yeah. yeah. So it's got a lot colder all of a sudden, doesn't it, Riley? What have we been eating? Donuts. Donuts with chocolate sauce. Are they nice? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Man's got a coffee to get warm. <laughs> so guys, that's the end of our three days at Folly Farm. Um, you might not be able to hear me brilliant because of the wind. Hope you've enjoyed it. Hope we've showed you enough of Folly Farm. Uh, it has been fantastic. Folly Farm will definitely be back for a couple of days again. The campsite is immaculate, it's clean. Highly recommend coming here. Um, and the kids will have an amazing time. So bring them here, have a good time. Okay guys, if you've liked what you've seen, if you wouldn't mind hitting the subscribe button, hit that like button, any questions, just drop it in the comments box and we'll answer as many as we can. Thanks for watching, see you on our next adventure.